so many years. Well, turning to weather right now, a live look at a dry Citizens Bank Park in South Philly this morning. All right, dry right now, but come Monday when the fills come back to Philly, not going to be dry out there, unfortunately. Uh -oh. Meteorologist Larissa Bray has a look at our next weather forecast. Are you are you shivering over there, Larissa? I'm trying know. to stay warm. I'm trying to stay warm. I know, it it's is cold. so chilly outside. And Jim is right. It's really chilly in here, but it is colder outside. All right. It is a cold start to this Friday morning. Here's a bit of good news, though. Dry air. One thing you need to know about it is that it warms and it cools rather rapidly. So as we approach the afternoon, we're actually going to be warming up, still staying cool because these numbers. Are slightly below what's considered average for this time of the year. We should be topping out in the middle 60s. Today, the best we're going to do is around 61 degrees. And that's in part due to clouds that will be filling in and kind of not letting the sun do its thing. So clouds build in, and that will just keep us right in the low 60s and even upper 50s in some spots. Now, it stays cool. I just showed you that. And the winds will be kicking up later today. But all in all, it's a dry Friday. We round out the week with dry conditions. Here's a quick peek at the weekend. Saturday's trending beautiful. We're actually going to see another great deal of sunshine with temperatures once again remaining cool in the low 60s. More, uh, more up to where we should be for this time of the year by Sunday. We're looking at highs to climb to around 64, 65, and we should see clouds build, but we stay dry. It's by Sunday night that rain begins to move in. And of course, let's take you down to Texas because we have our eyes glued on the Lone Star State. Rain will be moving in. Today, but remember, it is a retractable roof, so it shouldn't be hindering uh, the game. As we head towards Monday, though, back here at home, game three, you just saw this system travels right with the Phillies and it arrives here on Monday. This is also Halloween, so for trick or treaters, you will need an umbrella, maybe a poncho, and the same goes if you are heading down to Citizens Bank Park. The Phillies will be moving. Rather, uh, game three starts at around 8 o'clock, and we will see that rain move through the region. It will be exiting just in time for Tuesday. So, Tuesday, I actually went ahead and took out the rain showers, but this is what the next seven days look like. We're dry through Sunday. Sunday night, here comes the rain lingering into Monday. We're dry on Tuesday, and then we're also in the 70s throughout the majority of next week. It's trending warm. Sounds good. Thank you, Larissa.